Good morning, welcome back. And don't worry, it's not your eyes or your head playing tricks on you. I do in fact have a new background. We might be getting old and our knees haven't been the same since 2008, but we're not going senile just yet. You're gonna have to bear with me for like a month or two. I did move recently. My blinds are currently cardboard right now and my dining table is a carpet. Things are looking a little scuffed right now. So far the discourse on anti-aging is that it's pretty much a scam. Celebrity skincare brands haven't created a product that'll blast away your wrinkles. Scientists haven't found a magic drink that'll reverse all signs of aging. You can eat as much chicken and broccoli all you want, your back is still gonna hurt. Stem cells, exercise, expensive facial treatments can only do so much. Your body starts breaking down the second you are born and there's nothing you can do about it. Or does anti-aging actually work if you take it to the extreme? Well, this video wouldn't exist if there wasn't something that tempted me to jump down another rabbit hole. What if you had an unlimited amount of money, all the free time in the world, with the self-discipline of an NPC doing the exact same thing every day? It's another tale of a rich person doing rich people things. And regular people like you and me asking, why? But also, maybe I'll let him cook a little, cause this is interesting. This tycoon is 45, but he wants the body of his 18-year-old self. This is Brian Johnson, who is a centi-millionaire, which I had to Google because I've never heard that word in my life. Long story short, he's rich with a net worth of $100 million, which means nothing to me because I don't know a thing about money with that many zeros in it. Hey, all I know is that could be in his checking account. I don't know. <laughs> but it's not because most of it is going towards his quest of trying to age himself backwards to 18 again. Having financial freedom with nothing to worry about except missing your nap in a futuristic crib for robot babies sounds amazing. Other than the sun shining down, slow cooking our faces every day, stress is one of the top reasons we start aging faster. If that's all we had to worry about, of course everyone would look 20 to 30 years younger. House parties and raves are going to be serving senior coffees and bran muffins to youthful looking grandmas and grandpas. No one's going to have wrinkles on their forehead from constant frowning, being disappointed at everything. Too bad life comes with the built-in feature of stressing you out for no reason. So I moved into a house recently and having a house is pretty nice. You get your own private space with no one to bother you, which is perfect for homebodies and introverts like me. It'll also have you feeling broke for the first few months cause you'll be living like this. I need a couch. And since I've been trying to furnish the place so it doesn't look like I live in a giant white room with no belongings, Karma, the sponsor for today, has been my favorite find for shopping online. It's a free app and browser extension that helps you save money so you don't have to wonder if you missed out on any extra savings. And to make it super easy, you can get it right now on your phone or desktop just by clicking the link in the description. If you're like me and you're tired of manually searching for coupon codes, Karma does the work for you. They'll scan the web for the best ones and apply them automatically when you check out. And if there aren't any active codes, no worries. Karma will give you real-time notifications when the thing you've been eyeing does go on sale or comes back in stock. Did I also mention you can get cash back when you shop through Karma? Which is basically free money for shopping online. So I went from this to this. Um... It's a working progress, okay? I do have one more thing to add to my living room. The Karmacation giveaway worth $800. Where did I get this from? Karma is known for their awesome giveaways and they really went all out with the summer theme. There's a Kodak retro camera in here, an Apple AirTag for traveling, hydro flask bottle to stay hydrated, sunscreen from Supergoop, a mini projector, summer essentials, and games to play with friends. My favorite is this cooler that, surprise, doubles as a Bluetooth speaker. And I'm not just showing you just to show you. You can also win this $800 giveaway too by heading over to at karma underscore shop now on Instagram. Make sure you know what karma is by downloading the extension using my link so you can get ready to save money and win a giveaway. Brian Johnson is the world's most measured human. Johnson sold his company Braintree Venmo to PayPal for $800 million in 2013. Wait a second. The Venmo? The, the app, app that traumatizes, traumatizes people, people from paying, paying for a large group supper because they'll, they'll never get paid back the amount they're, they're actually owed? I know that app. Good for him. Since then, he's been investing millions to reduce the amount he ages each year. Just a modest 2 million a year. Not really liking the return on investment for this, but okay. Rich people are built different. If I were to implement a perfect dietary anti-aging regimen. Could I demonstrate neutralizing my aging? Not doing full reversal, but just a one year of chronological time passes and my biological age stays the same. Could I do that? And that's what I've been doing for the past year is using the best science 
and a, a team of world-class doctors trying to do all the appropriate interventions to neutralize my aging process. So to me, he looks interesting. <laughs> Not in a bad way, but it's a little uncanny. There's a comment pointing out he looks 30 and 50 at the same time. By no means does he look 18. The face isn't necessarily giving teenager. He does, however, look like a sprightly 40-year-old man on an 18-year-old's body. When you get older, you start losing collagen and volume in your face, which makes your cheekbones and the hollows of your face more prominent. It's why people with fuller faces age better, because there's more fat to lose. Here's a picture of him when he was younger, with a fuller-looking face. Now he has the bone structure of someone in their 40s, with less wrinkles than me. Or does he? His face looks so smooth with no imperfections and signs of aging, but in this TikTok where he was zapping his pelvic floor with some sort of machine, he does look his age. Could be the lighting, filters, or makeup on his skin. It could have even been unintentionally done. Used for incontinence, similar to the Kegel exercise that a lot of people do. Oh my god. Nice <laughs> oh, jump scare. Pulls everything together. These muscles don't get a lot of exercise in life. It doesn't create stimulation. It's like if you if you have a feeling like you're going to flatulate and you don't want to do it, it's like tensing the muscles to keep you from doing that. So one of his main goals is to have the butthole of an 18 year old, which great, he's going to be able to hold in his fart for a year. Where exactly does the fart go? Gotta say it, nowadays, beauty standards are out of control. Have you seen what they did to the new Barney? A nose job, facelift, buckle fat removal, lipo, and a jaw shaving. These two transformations have the same energy. This is basically a lifelong lab experiment done on a human, where one person is sacrificing their entire life to see if their body can stay the same without aging. By optimizing everything from his diet, his workout routines, and his lifestyle. So my diet every day is roughly 2,000 calories. So it's a 20 25% calorie reduction of what I would normally consume. So I'm on a caloric restriction diet. So you're hungry all the time? I'm hungry all the time. In fact, let me... All the time? I know that fasting once in a while is good for you, but what's the point of living to 100 if you're gonna be hungry every day? I have like no willpower to do that. You ever heard of eating cheese at 2 a.m. or late night hot pot or all you can eat sushi? My God, I am so hungry. In fact, let me ask you really fast before yeah. we get into this. Does your life suck? <laughs> I've never been happier or more fulfilled or more energized. I've never ever been in a better state in my entire life. Said with so much energy, as you can tell. Calm down, man, you are scaring me. This is like when Dumbledore calmly asked Harry. Harry, you put your name in a cup of fire. So he starts his day at 5.30 a.m. with a handful of supplements and pills and washes it all down with a drink called the Green Giant, which is just a bunch of powders mixed with water. When you look at this, you may wonder <laughs> if it's disgusting. It's not. It's delicious. And supposedly, it smells like cat food. It smells like cat food, Brian. <laughs> it tastes good, though. It's delicious. Wow. It really does smell like cat food, but it doesn't taste like, not that I know what cat food tastes like, but it doesn't taste like I expected from the smell. Ooh, y'all smell something? I don't know. Even cats are telling me they won't even drink that. Since he only eats the same amount of calories every day, he's restricted himself to a vegan diet consisting of fruits, vegetables, and lentils. This is super veggie. I eat around 50 pounds a month of vegetables. I think most people are shocked by this has been one mil, but it's uh, broccoli, cauliflower, ginger, garlic. Okay, I was a little scared, but for a vegan diet, that doesn't look too bad. It does look kind of bland. Can we have some salt or is that too many calories? Wow, everybody's so creative. Could you eat the exact same thing every single day? I would be so stressed making sure I don't accidentally inhale dust or breathe in the air at a fried chicken place. Cause that's like one one hundredth of a calorie. Brian also exercises for one hour every single day and he hasn't missed a single day for the past six months. His gym program consists of 25 different exercises and he also regularly monitors his weight and body fat. I spend an hour to two hours depending on the day and you get to think about everything and think about nothing. It's quiet every single day until 9 in the morning. Same. I don't think I've deviated from it once. 
okay, but what happens if you get sick all of a sudden? Your data is going to be all skewed and you're going to lose all your progress and gains. The gains, bro. I do have a feeling he doesn't get colds or the flu very often since he's turned his body into an optimized machine, but I know that one bite of a Baconator will actually kill this person for real. Remember when I said he spends two million a year trying to turn himself into a teenager again? He's hired a huge team of doctors to run tests on every single part of his body down to the hemoglobin. Tech entrepreneur Brian Johnson wants to reverse the aging process in his brain, heart, lungs, liver, kidneys, teeth, skin, hair, everything. Call me ridiculous or extreme or eccentric. The funny thing is they have no idea. <laughs> I actually do more than they're aware of. I suppose I'm extra plus or ridiculous plus. It's a full-time job for sure, maybe even more. So is any of this working? His doctors claim he has the heart of a 37-year-old, the skin of a 28-year-old, and the lung capacity of an 18-year-old. So the only people telling us this data is his team of doctors that he's paying. Could they be biased since their boss is keeping the lights on and their bills paid? Maybe. He did break the world record of how slow someone can age. He reduced his epigenetic age by 5.1 years and 7 months. So instead of aging the regular 365 days a year for humans, he slowed down to only aging 9 months a year. Good thing he has his very own 18 year old son to compare himself to. Are you trying to get bigger? I want to be like you, yeah. What are we doing? How, how, how similar or dissimilar? You're the same waist. <laughs> this is also an age test. What kind of weird competition is this? This program he created is called Blueprint. He actually shares his entire routine, his diet, and the data he's collected for free, so people can have the resources to recreate his anti-aging routine. My results from using two years of Blueprint. 5.1 years epigenetic age reversal. Slowed my pace of aging by 31 years. Ideal muscle and fat. This one really stuck out to me. Now aging more slowly than the average 10 year old. Congrats, you won over a kid at aging. He's even got his sons on this program. My 16 and 18 year old boys are doing a lot of this. My 12 year old daughter is not. <laughs> she is not yet subscribed to the program. You have these teens in their development years living life with so many restrictions. I feel like that's not very healthy mentally and physically. I don't know anything, but at least wait until you look old enough to get your driver's license at least. They're never gonna let a 14 looking 18 year old into the club. Do you just become bored with life when you have so much money? I admire the self-discipline and science experiment we're witnessing. Someone gotta do it, I guess. But is living life like this really worth it? Being hungry every single day I prefer living life in moderation. You know, like eat an unhealthy burger, then eat an apple. Stay up all night playing video games, then just sleep the entire day the next day. When you take things to the extreme, especially with your body, that's when things can go wrong. Dr. Rigved Tadwalker says trying to reverse the aging process could be dangerous. Anything taken to an extreme, including a mix of supplements, excessive exercise, excessive changes to the diet, can potentially be harmful to the body. I do think it's pretty interesting how he's actually able to reverse his age in a way, while you don't specifically see it on his face. You can tell he's probably healthier than most 30, maybe even some 20 year olds, according to these doctors that he's paying. Aging also comes down to genetics. There's a handful of Japanese people that have lived over the age of 100, and they were doing way less than what this guy is doing. Hey, at least he's being transparent about the reality of what it actually takes to live this lifestyle. Like, this does not look enjoyable at all. Another guy named Brian Johnson, Another one, or as you might know him, the Liver King. The thing that made him famous was his claim, you could look exactly like him by going on a raw meat diet consisting of liver, lifting weights, and telling everyone it's all natural from hard work. Oh, and don't forget about the masculine urge to lie about taking a bunch of steroids. I swear, we're living in a reality TV show where everyone named Brian is goofy. How far would you go to live a longer life? All I do is take some vitamins, walk my dog every day, and take a nap when I need it. Is living for forever really that great? Most of us won't actually get to know because not everyone can be a lab experiment for funsies. I'm already done like 30% of my life and I'm kind of tired. And not to be grim, but like, is the earth still gonna be here in like a hundred years? Got all that money with no spaceship to the moon or fallout shelter in his backyard? There are two types of people in the world, I tell ya. All I know is that the only beings that deserve to live longer than their expected age are dogs or pets in general. Give this video a like if you agree to feed the algorithm and the YouTube algorithm's favorite pet, me, will get to pop up on your recommended whenever something new gets posted. Have a good day, try not to be dumb, and I'll see you in the next one.